Welcome back to Crypto Gains for another video. I want to talk about AI, deep fake, all the stuff that's happening with artificial intelligence and how it's really improving and it can seriously disrupt and cause a lot of problems for many people to come. Celebrities, more so celebrities than us. Hear the dog. What are you doing? Your feet are too loud, you're making noise. Every step that you walk, I'm talking about AI. Every step that you take is making noise. <laughs> She's like, yeah, I don't care. <laughs> Go on, walk away. Sorry for the, no the steps. On a serious note, we need to talk about this because AI is seriously, seriously advancing and, it's, and I'm seeing things that's actually blowing my mind away. So, you know, if you're new, welcome in, drop the like, give me a subscribe if you're interested in AI, deep fake, and how we can seriously try and figure out a way to, I don't even know, like, what can we do? There's nothing we can do. Let me start off with this. And this is mad. For just $15, AI-generated fake IDs are undermining crypto KYC efforts. What? This shouldn't even be a thing. But please understand... What I've been saying to you for the last sort of six months about how AI is improving, how deep fakes are a big issue in this space. Now you can get people to do fake IDs. This is not a good thing. And like, you know the face. How can something look so flipping real? If this is what AI can do with an image and then you can just upload it like a KYC to get like authenticated, there's a big problem that we have. And this is just the start. This is stuff that's happening in 2024. What's it gonna be like in 2030 as AI advances? So we need to really think about these things because this is imagery, this is fake imagery. And as time goes on, the video imagery is gonna be more realistic. I've seen these fake things where they talk about, you know, oh, I'm a, what's his face? Can't remember his face. I am something, something, can't remember his name. What's his name? Michael Saylor. And if you click this, don't click that crap. It's a flipping scam. I'm just saying that it's becoming more advanced and the video space is going to be the scariest of them all, especially for content creators, for celebrities. Everybody might end up losing their job. You, may, you might not no longer need to, you know, have what's his face, Tom Cruise, come up to you and say, hey, look, I want to do a video with you because you can have a fake AI generate and make you look just like it, we no longer need you anymore. It's just insane. So, and, and then on top of that, people may be using these faces to do bad things. So we need to really kind of open our minds to this and really try and figure out a way to solve the issue, which is why I feel like Open Fabric, and this is not financial advice, I've just been looking at this project more, why I feel like Open Fabric as a company, as an AI project in the crypto space, if they can tackle this problem with the deep fake that says available soon, if they can start detecting this, this stuff where you can detect that actually this is a fake, then maybe this could probably be one of the biggest AI projects we've ever seen in our, in our lifetime or any, for any, any AI project for that matter of fact. Whether it's Fetch, whether it's uh, Singularity Net, whichever one it is, I think the first one to tackle this problem here will be the biggest project of them all, especially in, in the crypto space because we need to get on top of this thing. People are using things like AI Parrot. And I know you've seen the advert. Maybe you're chilling on your phone on your, 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 what's it called? Your TikTok or your Instagram. And then you see, oh, use AI Parrot. You can make your voice sound like someone else. Sounds fun at the start because you can trick your friends and pretend you're talking to someone or they're talking to someone like a celebrity. But when you look at the back end of it and really start to think about it, actually, how good is this? And what, how is it helping people in the long run? In the long run? Who is it going to affect in the future? Look, popular AI voices like Elon Musk, Zuckerberg, Mr. Beast, Mia Khalifa. The, look, AI generators. Look, Joe Biden, Obama. Ugh, we've got to be careful, man. We've got to be so careful with this stuff. I guarantee you there's going to be new laws that come into place, new AI laws where people will be getting sent if you do not, if you use this in the wrong shape or form, because people do. It's all fun and fine having fun of it now. It's fun now, but it is, it's when it starts affecting people's lives, that's when it becomes a big issue. And if we can't detect it, 
We're flipping done, man. We are absolutely done. We need to we need to detect it. And this is why I'm betting money on something like it, Open Fabric. That actually says, look, maybe I don't know, Open Fabric. If you're watching this, I don't because you know this ain't sponsored, or someone push it to them. Just this should be the next thing you push. Forget everything else. I don't care what's highlighted, what isn't highlighted. This part here, the deep fake, push that first. Trust me, push it first because that's what's going to set you up for greatness. That's what's going to make your, your price absolutely explode in price. And I, I can't even stress that enough because right now there's a big problem here and we need to be able to detect this. You should be able to, I should be able to right click and save this image. Yeah. Run it through a AI scanner, a deep fake scanner. Is that what that is? Is that what that is? A deep fake scanner where I just I, I upload an image and it scans and it tells me if it's a real image or a fake. That's what this needs to be. So, yeah, I just wanted to share my thoughts on like the whole AI space and how it's been seriously advanced over these coming months and what can potentially come for the future. We might not even need to have like people could start making fake YouTube channels, start using big YouTube Mr. Beast's face. I mean, you if you get his face, you've got his flipping voice right here. You could do it live. What do you need him for when you've got Mr. Beast's face, right? You can use his face. You've got his flipping voice here. Do you see what I'm saying? It can be dangerous in the wrong hands. So um, I wanted to put a serious topic on this, like really discuss it and just open the minds to, uh, and try, hopefully you guys can eventually in the future try and see that actually a lot of these are fake. They're not real people. They're people, you know, deep faking these others. And hopefully we can be aware of it because it might be fun for you to start off with, but at some point it's going to be an issue and it, it maybe it could affect your life in the future. You don't know. So, um, yeah, just wanted to share my visions on this. It's, it's totally different out of the topic of other normal videos that I do. But uh, yeah, if you know if you liked it, if it was helpful to you, drop that like, give me a subscribe. What do you think on this whole AI stuff advancing? I love the chat GPT. I love, you know, I can sit there all day long with that because they got the new update, right? And you can talk to it. I, and you know, it gives you helpful information, uh, all sorts of stuff. So, you know, you can come on, see? It loads up and then you just ask it a little question and just like talk to it and just ask it whatever you want. So I like that. It's not doing anything when it's just connecting. Uh, and that's going to be great. That can definitely help people in the future. I can see it taking over like the Google. I can see Google having a new type of like, you know, AI assistant like that, where you don't, you don't type anymore. You just tap a button, talk to it, done. And it gives you the answers immediately. So yeah, I'm going to leave it here. Guys, thanks for watching. Hope you have a good day. I'm checking to make sure you can see my screen. If you want to become a Patreon, links in the info section. Click it. I see people coming over. Welcome in. Yeah, new people. Uh, and yeah, you choose your tears. And I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Cheers. Oh, 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 oh.